Hey, KIC here. Welcome back to Life in Bunker. I am an idiot, and I forgot to make a fridge to store all of the vegetables that we are now growing, which is actually pretty exciting. I'm kind of glad to finally see that we have some stuff. That's kind of handy dandy right there. That's what that is. We need a fridge, so um, yeah, I know. I'm working on it. I'm working on it. I need someone to build that fridge, though, so we can uh, start cultivating our, our stuff. And we're not actually starving. It's just that no one's cooking because I don't know why. Someone's cooking. You're not cooking. That's uh, because we have we don't have a canteen still. That's why. Ah oh, man, we need to place the canteen somewhere. Ah, uh, we didn't do that at the last episode, did we? I talked about it and then I didn't do it. I don't know why I didn't do it. Let's put it right there. That looks like a marvelous place to put a canteen. If I were a canteen, that is where I would want to be. I tell you what. Yep, I would be all over that spot right there. That would be it. That would be the spot. I think we need to think a little bit about our production system here. Uh, we also need to research a garbage recycler. We're doing that right away. We're going to need to make a garbage recycler before too long because this thing is going to fill up much quicker than it might otherwise appear. We're okay for now, but we will need to keep that in mind. So... Let's go ahead and fill in these floors for the time being. And I need to check on our incubators to see how they're doing. They might be ready to go. I'm not really sure. Let's go ahead and get rid of that. Target that one. I guess I didn't target that last time. This is really nice that I can finally get rid of these floors. Or, well, they're not floors, you know what I mean. But get rid of these uh, little areas here. Come on, guys. Everyone get the mole men. Nice work. Nice work all around there. Very pleased with that, everyone. You did a good job. Okay, let's go ahead and get rid of these floors, or these uh, walls, rather. Let's get rid of that one, too. And we'll queue up some more floors to be placed. So, there you go. As soon as you are done, you just got to pop floors down. That's just the way it is. You can't leave these floors open for long before you get Molmen popping through. They are ruthless that way. They really are. You gotta keep up on this. Come on, guys. Alright. While you're doing that, let's check on the incubator. Uh, you're not the incubator. You are the incubator. We need to get that guy running again. We're also going to need more water and more oxygen. Before too long, anyway. Not enough space for vegetables. Oh, I didn't set it as vegetables. Sorry. There you go. Store the vegetables. Store them. Okay, let's stop and take a moment here. Okay. Stop and take a moment to see what other research things we can do. Speed up decomposition. That's interesting. Cleaning. That's all kind of good stuff. That one, actually, I kind of like the idea of that. Those refineries don't work fast enough for me. Bunk bed. That would save some space. I don't really care about this stuff too much. Although that treadmill might be a good idea. They spend less time on that than the bike. Let's go and research that. Um, we don't need the diamond drill bit just yet, I don't think. Uh, sorry, go back to research. Big reactor, big air purifier. I think we're okay on that stuff. We will need a smaller air purifier soon, I think. And then we're back to that stuff. We should probably do some more farming. Toolbox. Hmm. I like the sound of that. And I like the sound of that because a lot of time gets spent on checking or fixing stuff. Oh, that might be good too. Hmm. Okay, well, we need to get an infirmary up running very quickly here. So let's go ahead and make that our next focus because we're going to have problems here with these guys are sick. Yeah, we really need to do this. Oh, you know what? I forgot to do it from the last episode. We need more guys doing stuff, so let's have another janitor. And we need another cook. I think that'll be fine. And then let's see, what do we need for an infirmary? Are you under residential zone? Infirmary. That's going to be 150, so we can go ahead and make that right now. Let's do that. Let's go ahead and put an infirmary down right now. That's not the one I meant to click on. And then we need to give it water at the very least. Nope, or power, sorry, not water.
probably going to need to place more floors down. So let's go ahead and do that before we lose anyone. Okay. Yeah, yeah. You can whine about the food later. Keep going. You guys are doing fine. Don't worry about it. There's still enough food to eat. Ish. Maybe. Possibly. Probably need to put more vegetable patches down, but we're getting there. This is, um... I'm feeling pretty good right now. This is probably the best start we've ever had. This is this is not too too bad. Could be worse. Could be much, much worse. Okay, so we do have some vegetables in there. And um, I'm going to do it. I'm going to go ahead and increase that one more time. Why not? Just because I really think that's going to be helpful to have those producing as quickly as possible. Now we need to set up another scientist. Oh boy, what do we do? We need another scientist here. Oh, we should probably research. Oh no, we can do that. We just need research points to do it. Uh, as soon as that infirmary is done, we need to save some points to pop out a couple of scientists. That would be a good idea, I think. Let's set you as a scientist. We're going to put... Uh, these are my farmers. We're going to put you on repair work for the time being. Let's give you a four. And then we need to start changing the priority on some of these things. Give you a priority of five. These are my big things. Everything kind of fails without them. Food needs to be pretty high up. Incubator, you need to be rather high. These guys need to be high too, because if these fail, we are toast. And then let's go ahead and put these guys up. Okay, we do have a scientist now who is, or a doctor who is manning the station over here. We don't have any patients that are being seen, but we do have folks who could be seen. So we're not doing too poorly here. Let's go ahead and go to our residential stuff and go, no, resting. Sorry, we want to go to resting. We're going to go ahead and put down a treadmill. I did research that, so let's go ahead and put that down because... I have actually neglected to put an exercise cycle down. So let's go ahead and put the treadmill down. And I feel like we should probably put another toilet cabin down. So we'll put another one of those down. And yeah, I'm gonna I'm just gonna leave them facing that random direction. That makes no sense. Uh floors. Let's put you guys down there. They're all talking. I hear them jibber jabbing. They're they're talking to me. They're saying, dude, you're doing this wrong. You are so doing this wrong. So far, though, I think we're actually looking pretty decent. We've only gone four cycles, and yet we have all the the big stuff done, the main stuff. We don't have that done, so let me go ahead and put another floor down. As soon as you are done, please. Come on. Drill away, my friends. Yeah, that one takes a little while. I understand. It's kind of a big one. There you go. And now go ahead and put that flooring down for me, please. Would appreciate that. How much do we need? How many materials do we need to make a mining machine? We need a hundred, so we're not quite there yet. Let's go ahead and go into our research again. I talked about doing this, but I didn't quite, so... Hmm, yeah, I don't know. I. Mm, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> ah, let's do the oil refinery. Because I feel like we do a, a lot of time waiting... I'm going to do it twice. That's fine. Because now that... Yeah, look how fast that's going now. That's that's good. I feel like we just spend a lot of time waiting for resources to be built. Uh -huh. And that's not a good thing. How is everyone doing? Oh, look at that. Everyone has been treated for their health. I'm feeling really good about that. I'm feeling optimistic now about that. We're almost at 100, so let's go ahead and get that guy ready. Because we're going to want that to be placed down as quickly as we can. And can I not place you right there? There we go. I didn't have the... The materials when I first went to do it, so I didn't know what to do. I think that was the problem. And then we can just go ahead and I think that will work as a node and we can go ahead and connect things like so. Should probably put another vegetable patch down. I don't think we have enough materials to do that. It's all right. How are we doing on power here? 33% and no, sorry, that's uh, 300 kilowatts and 100 40 liters of water, so we're just about done. We do need another water pump here shortly, so we're going to have to take care of that. That guy is running. It's going to be mining away. That's good. We can let that go. 
We're not looking too poorly here. Embryos are still cooking. If I just take a look here, is anyone else ready to work? These guys are going to be ready soon, but we're also going to have folks ready to retire soon, so we need to kind of keep that in mind. I think what we should probably do as well is place some more beds. I have placed these rather haphazardly because um, it's just the way things happened. What can I say? Uh, you have a shower pod. Someone's using it. It's not. No one's even using it. Oh, come on. Yep, you're in the toilet. Good for you. I was actually trying to target the toilet. There you go. Just to get them some work. Make sure they're ready to go. Are you waiting for the toilet? You need some exercise. Well, there's a treadmill over there. Go use it. Oh, you need power, don't you? Ah, oh, crud. I'm sorry, guys. I didn't realize you needed... Well, duh, of course that makes sense. Here, let's put it like that. Um, I think they can get that. Yep. Of course a treadmill needs power. That makes all the sense in the world. I just didn't think about that when I placed it. Because I don't know why. I just didn't think about it. Look at that. Go use the go, go use the treadmill. Ah, oh, my goodness. I feel bad for these people. I am so bad to them. Dance machine. How much is that going to cost? 20, 25. Hmm. Two residents can use the dance machine simultaneously. I do like the idea of that. I'm not going to research that just yet, though. Okay, we have 152 building materials. Let's go ahead and place another farm down. We're going to place another vegetable patch, so... I think what we can do is put them like that, and that'll actually work because those spots will be able to be used by anyone. I hope. I hope both sides can, can use that. I'm not 100% sure... We should probably research placing other growing type things too. I'm sure they would be feeling better if they could grow some other things aside from just vegetables. Since we already have a fish aquarium, let's go ahead and research the fish aquarium. And then uh, I'm going to leave that right now. We're not going to do, we're not going to spend those research points just yet. Okay, what do we have going on here? Don't eat mole man meat, you're an idiot. Um, they haven't been suffering from diseases for a long time. They have a doctor. This guy's just an idiot. Don't give me that. That is such BS. Such BS. Okay, so we have people growing up. Who are these newbies? You're going to be an engineer because we don't have enough of them. You're going to be a scientist. I'm actually really, really happy one of them is capable of being a scientist. Oh. Uh, that's kind of a relief, honestly. That really is kind of a relief. We're going to need another air purifier, I think. Yeah, there we go. Look at that. How is that for timing? I, I thought as much. Okay, I'm going to pause it. Let's go ahead and put down another air purifier. We can do a small one, and it'll be sufficient for now, because I hate to say it this way, but we're going to have people die in here in a little while, so we don't necessarily need to go crazy with um, building... A bunch of big ones. We should probably research the large ones at some point, but for right now we're okay. So we have scientist who is researching. We have another scientist who is... I don't know, maybe you're not a scientist. You guys are standing around. Let's take a look. We should probably open up some more space because we can build some more things in here. And I would like to place... Let's see, we have 199 building materials. So let's place a fish aquarium. Oh, that needs a lot of room, doesn't it? Okay, whatever. We have we have space. We can do this. It's not a big deal. So we'll go ahead and put that down there. And theoretically, we'll have someone taking care of that. That'll be that'll be good. Looking forward to that actually. Do we have anyone else who is ready to go? We're going to have a water problem. Yes, that's right. I did mention we're going to have a water problem now, didn't I? Okay. Our engineers will take care of that. We're about at the point of the game where everything is going to start breaking. So it's just going to be the way it is. Now, I have placed some concrete. I don't have 250, though, so I could put it over here. So we have concrete ready to go over here, and that that refinery is moving quickly enough that I don't necessarily feel like it's going to be holding us back to only have one. Let's go ahead and mark those for destruction. How many miners do we have? Builders, constructors, engineers? We have three of them. So we're not doing too poorly in that regard. 
We'll get some guys over there taking care of that. And then we're going to need to place some... What is that? The fish aquarium was constructed. Okay, that's good. Yeah, we have water issues right now. I know that. I'm working on it, folks. I'm, I'm really trying. This is this is time consuming though. This takes me a little time. So I gotta I gotta coordinate everything. That's uh no. Don't do that. Let's let's leave that as concrete. There we go. I gotta kinda get, you know, the plan in place. I gotta tell everyone what we're going to be doing and make sure we're all on board. So it takes me a little time, folks. Just be patient with me and I'll get you another water pump. Uh yeah, I know. I know. I'm just asking for another couple seconds. That's all I need. Another couple seconds. All right, let's place a water pump right there. Now, theoretically, with this new patch, this is going to take care of any... Uh, it'll uh, rather... not. I won't take care of it. It'll negate the need to have separate systems for everything. So look at this. We should be good to go right about... Come on. Right about now. All right, there we go. So... We're only using 35 liters out of that one. This one's using the full thing. You can see almost the full thing. You can see that there's only a little bit of water left. That's the blue line. That tells you how much water is left in the system. So you don't necessarily have to click on it. You can just look at it. But I prefer to see the actual numbers just because I kind of know that some things will take certain amounts of food and or uh, will take certain amounts of water. So I just prefer to do that. That's all. Okay, so what are you? You are considered a child. These are... I don't know what eight is considered. I don't know how many how many years eight equates to. Because it's not eight years old, I can tell you that much. That is so not the case. Okay, you guys are preparing to plant. I would really like to see those move along a little quicker. Let's go ahead and pause again. We're going to look at... Ah, oh man. I'd like to get this going as soon as I can. Problem is, I would almost kind of like to let these guys mature here, just so we know what we're going to have. But let's go ahead and let's just make sure we get a couple of... Hmm. Here, let's do, let's do that. Interesting. So you can kind of set them to do multiple things. I wonder if you only set one. Is that the only thing they can do? I don't know. I'm not sure how that works exactly. We do have a few research points to play with. 138. I'm just kind of debating here. We're definitely going to need a farmer. We're definitely going to need a cook. We're definitely going to need a scientist. Let's just... Let's just run with that. And if those are the only things they can do, that's fine because chances are we're not going to get too many people who can only do one thing. That seems to be pretty rare. In fact, I don't even know if that happens really, but whatever, we're gonna say that's okay. Um, wow, that wasn't enough oxygen, huh? Oh, and now you're stuck. Ah. <sighs> I didn't even realize that. I am an idiot. All right, well, let's bust open the research and let's go to that guy. Hmm. I don't know what that one is doing. Not that one. I want this one. Big air purifier. Okay, so before we do anything else, can I even make one? What does that cost? It doesn't cost much. That's good. It's actually, that's really good. It requires a concrete floor. So let's go ahead and place it. I don't want to place it right there because that kind of blocks things off a little bit. Let's place that right there. And then with any luck, someone will build that very quickly because we're running out of oxygen and we're about to start having health issues here. And then I'll deconstruct this one over here and free that person from the corner. I know. It's almost good. It's almost good. Here, I don't want to turn it off just yet. Oh, maybe we run out of power. Ah, oh, crud. That's what the problem is. We've run out of power. Oh, I didn't realize that. Oh, crud. Crud, crud, crud. Um, crud. Crud, crud, cruddy, crud, crud. Hmm. 
Let's turn that off for the time being. We still have too much power draw. And that's going to need 10. Is that enough to, to let it run? Nope. Still not enough. And we still need to get her out of that corner anyway. Poor kid is stuck there. Ah, man. It's always something dumb like this. Okay. If we do that... Nope. Oh, that needs ox or it needs water too. That's the problem there. Okay, are we down to fourth? Nope, we're still not down to where we need to be. We need to lose another ten. All right, let's turn that one off for now. We're going to turn this one on. So now we have enough oxygen. Theoretically. Theoretically, there we go. Good. So let's go ahead and dismantle this, and we will free that poor kid from the corner. Uh, I guess I should get rid of that light and build it in the corner. Build the purifier in the corner instead. We've actually run out of ore, so this is really bad. Okay, so... I don't even know how much oxygen we need. Can I turn that one off? Okay. Uh-oh. Crud. What happened? What happened? What happened? Oh. By disassembling that, that took out the cable. Good. Okay, someone needs to go fix that quickly. Come on. Put that cable up. Yeah, fix it. That's kind of important. Everyone's going to die if you don't. Good. Oof. That one's not working. Why isn't that one working? Hmm, did we lose a did we lose a water pipe? Is that what happened? I don't understand. Hmm. That is bizarre. That one's not working now. Why aren't you working? Oh, did I turn you off? Oh, that's right. I turned that one off. Sorry. I turned that one off. Okay, let's see what happens if I turn that one off. We're still going up, so theoretically these... I know. Those two guys are enough right now. We need more power. So let's turn this guy back on because we need more ore. So we can get more building materials so we can have more power. We need to basically get over to this resource, resource patch as well. We need to do that quickly. Uh, if we go to life support and we look up... Hmm. That actually doesn't help. A mini reactor. 350. Holy cow. Wow. That's a lot. Oof. That is a lot. We're kind of not really running on the best system right now. Oh, uh, geez. All right. Let's clear a pathway. This is where everything starts to go bad, and it all goes downhill. But we will catch up with it more on the next episode now that we've queued some stuff up. So far, they're still alive after seven cycles, and aside from... The snot looks like everyone is more or less doing okay-ish. They might not be happy, but they're surviving, and that's going to have to be good enough here. Have the treadmill back. You probably need that. Yeah, that's going to have to be good enough for now. So we'll catch up on the next one. Thumbs up, thumbs down. Do consider subscribing if you have not already, and I'll see you on the next episode. Thanks for watching. See you later.